Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Welcome to another episode of The Body Beatdown. I'm Michael, your incredible host. <clears throat> today is chest day on the Smith Machine flat bench. Today, this week, also is week number four of my routine that I've been doing for, oh, you know, going on four weeks now, uh, where I take one body part and I do one movement, the same movement for, for six weeks, just uh, for an experiment to see what exactly that movement does. Uh, why? Because I want to. It's something I kind of come up with and uh, it's something I'm interested in. And uh, not only that, but it's given my body a break from the dozens of other movements so that whenever I do go back to my normal training, hey, my body's level to respond in a more positive way. You know, give yourself a little break from some stuff and things can happen. So if you also notice, I turned my rack around. I was told that uh, maybe I should turn it around by someone uh, who commented on one of my videos. <clears throat> uh, because of the way it unracks, uh, I have a hard time when it's turned the other way, uh, trying to get the latches latched back on and it's very difficult. So this way, um, my hands naturally want to go that way whenever I'm benching from this direction so it makes it a little easier to latch back on now I haven't I've not uh, tried it with any weights on it I've only used it just with the empty bar just to test it out and uh, it seems like it's gonna be a little bit easier and today we're gonna find out also if you go and check out my other videos you'll know that I actually finally weighed the bar now it's not just the bar, it's also the whole carriage thing that runs up and down on the guide rods. And it came up to 57 pounds. So I do add the 57 pounds and the weight plates now, which comes up to a strange weight. You know, when I tell you what the weight is and when I write it down and everything, it's kind of strange looking, but you need to add it. And I've not really done that since I've had this machine. So anyway, Let's go ahead and get a nice little warm-up set. I got the 35s on, and uh, we'll see how it goes, all right, guys? I'm not even going to cut. I'm just going to do this right here, if you don't mind. Do that right there. I'm going to tilt this down just a hair, get a little vision. You want to see right at my crotchal region whenever I lay down. You know, nice crotch view. <clears throat> so, and also a perk to having my, to having the rack turn this way is I get to use the weight horns. Before they were against the wall and I couldn't use them. So, you know. Ugh. And I don't have my gloves and my wraps on right now, but I probably will in just a minute because uh, I do have kind of cruddy wrists. But we'll see. <clears throat> Let's talk about that first set. So uh, it did feel a little bit easier whenever I latched it back on. So uh, from here, I'm gonna go and uh, take those off and put some uh, 45s on, okay guys? So I don't know if we're gonna film the whole thing. I just kind of wanted to get a documentation of the first time that I'm really using it since turning it around. So uh, we'll see what happens. If you see more video, good. If not, I'll sign out in a minute. Stick around. All right, I went ahead and I got 45s on there and 25s and we got it up to one, 197. Remember that's with the bar and the carriage and all, so it's weird numbers. So we just have to deal with it, guys. Let's see what we do because this is getting right up there close to that threshold of where I've been uh, on this machine.
So that felt pretty decent, guys. So I don't see me going up 300 pounds or anything like the good old days or 375 like the good old days, but hey, not too bad. Let's get some more done. All right, I took 25s off and put 35s on. So now we're at 217. So let's take a look, guys, see what we think. <clears throat> now this is also, again, documentation of how I feel about the bar and how it's working for me in this direction. So. And also, again, I've told you before, uh, I have to put my feet up on this bench because it's a little bit too tall. I'm six one and a half barefoot. I'm six two in my shoes, and it's still too tall for me. And it, when I put my feet down, it just stretches my back out too much and tweaks it. So I have to put my feet up. Eventually, I'm going to get a different bench. Good job. Again, it's a strange weight. I put 45s on, and so now it's 237 pounds. Uh, let's get a little different angle over here, guys. And uh, get a little different angle, a little bit like so. All right. Now, this is up there with some of the heaviest I've tried to do on this thing. Again, I'm not a strong bencher anymore. I'm just not. So, if I can get four reps, I'll be happy. I'll be amazed if I get four. Let's see if we can go up a little bit more, guys. Oh. All right, I put a 10 on each side, so now that's 257. All right, guys, I put a five on each side, so now we're up to 267. I'm not gonna bore you anymore after this set. So uh, let's go ahead and get this set done and then we'll sign out, okay? Hopefully I'll get one rep and I'll be happy. Come on, join this occasion with me. If my battery lasts long enough, I got 
two. Good job. Well, guys, from here, I'm going to go ahead and sign out. I'm going to keep doing my workout. I don't want to bore you with no more. This is just something to give you, you know, a little entertainment and for some documentation for me. So I appreciate you watching. Go check out all my videos. I try to do good, positive, awesome things every day. Whether my videos are 10 seconds long or an hour long. And I got some on there. So go check them out. Look in the playlist. Look in the video section. Look everywhere, guys. You'll find me. Be an inspiration to someone today. Be an inspiration to yourself even more so. Because at the end of the day, you matter more than anyone in this world. Okay? Don't forget. Like, share, subscribe, comment. All that good stuff. To me, the body beatdown, Michael. And get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. I gotta finish this chest up. Pa -da. Get up, get out, get ready, and do it, do it!